sometimes the biggest words are the little ones, the tiniest of words. Like there's a comment in Judges chapter 4. And there's a woman named Deborah, and she's the judge. She's the most powerful person in all of Israel. And she has called a man named Barak, because Deborah doesn't have military experience, and Barak does. And she calls on him and says, I want you to lead our army against our enemies. And then Barak says to her, in chapter 4, verses 8 and 9, If you go with me, I will go. But if you don't go with me, I won't go. Certainly I will go with you, said Deborah. But because of the course you are taking, you're doing something wrong, the honor will not be yours. For the Lord will defend Sisera, your enemy, into the hands of a woman. So Deborah went with Barak to Kadesh. And the key problem there is that word if. He says, if you go with me, I will go. Now, he's not talking to God. He's talking to Deborah. He's looking for somebody who can take some of the blame if things go wrong. Somebody to carry the responsibility. Now, there's some, sometimes when we say if to God or to God's appointed leader, that's okay. There's some good ifs. There's an, if you really want me to, I will, which is an if of faith. Lord, I'm going to do whatever you want me to do. I just got to make sure you want me to. So if you want me to, I'm on. The answer is yes. There's also an if of dependence, where I'm dependent on God. I can do this if you help me. Okay? But if you don't help me, there's nothing I can do. It's about, I'm wanting to obey you, God, but I need you in there. I can only do it if you help me. But Barak's if wasn't that if. It was the if of control. If you do it my way, God, I will do it. If you let me be in control of all the details, God, I will do it. If you do it my way, that's okay. And that's right on the cutting edge, right on the bleeding edge of the if of rebellion. It's an if with seeds of rebellion. So if there's something God's wanting you to do and you know it, and you're wanting to ask him if, it's okay to say, God, if you really want me to, I will. It's okay to say, God, I'll do it, but I know I'll only succeed if you do the work, do your part. But it's never good to have the if of rebellion, the if you do it my way, God, we're on. And you better check today to make sure there's nothing in your life where you're saying, God, I'll do it if you do it my way. And that's today's jump start.